There's so much anticipation leading up to this new film. What are you most excited for fans to see? I'm most excited for fans to see um, Lara Jean kind of come into her own a little bit more and kind of find her voice and her confidence um, and grow. That's the most exciting. And then I'm excited for people to see Jordan because I think he's amazing. In what ways has your character, Lara Jean, changed from the first film t to the second? In what ways has she stayed the same? <laughs> um, in what ways has she stayed the same? Her style is just as um, eccentric um, as the first, and she is, um, her anxiety is still there, and she's still very much lives in her head, and she's like, it's constant, like, running dialogue in her head. Um, and things that um, I think are different is that, that she just kind of harnesses her voice a little bit more and she, she is more okay with taking up space. Because I feel like in the first movie she was much more quiet and kind of drawn into herself. And I think in the sequel she just takes up a little bit more space and she's just growing as a young woman and it's exciting to see. So, yeah. Um, there's a few new faces in the film, most notably Jordan Fisher. Tell me what it was like working with him and what makes him the perfect John Ambrose. Um, listen, he is the perfect John Ambrose. He is, we read with so many people um, and all shapes and sizes and colors and he was, I talk about this all the time, when I read with Noah, when we chemistry read in the first movie, I knew, as soon as I read with him, I knew. That's Peter Kavinsky. This is this this is the connection that I know that that's him without a doubt. I had that same feeling when I read with Jordan, and I didn't have that. I, he was the only person I felt that with. He is just so charismatic, and he said in the chemistry, he said, "I just want to give John Ambrose a hug," and I was like, and that was even before he read, and I was like, "That's it. You, that's who I thought John Ambrose was as someone that I just wanted to give a hug and to love, and he's just amazing, and he's so kind and charismatic, and and and." And, and joyful and he's just wonderful and, and I can't wait for everyone to see him, his, his work because like the moment he comes on screen you're like, ah! yeah, so it's awesome. Um, another new face, uh, what was it like working with Holland Taylor? Ah, legend, icon, icon, she's amazing. She is, I mean, she is just a seasoned professional um, and it was just really refreshing because she kind of represents this kind of female, like older female, um, kind of a mother figure because Lara Jean lost her mother and she, she doesn't have that kind of like mother figure in her life. And so working with Holland was so amazing because one, it was just like uh, a lesson in acting every single day and she's so connected and she's so present and, and so funny and questions everything. And that was just so refreshing to see and awesome. And, and she was just very, very giving. like. You know, we spent long hours together and, and everything. She's just giving. She's a giving actress. And I hope, like, I love her career. And I, I hope I get to work as long as she does, uh, that she has. But it's just really inspiring to see someone that's so incredible. Um, you filmed the second and third films back to back. What was it like reuniting with everyone and spending all that time with them? Oh man, we did do it back to back, two and three. Um, it was like coming home because, you know, the first movie, like the exposure of the first movie was, we didn't realize that that was going to happen. And so all of a sudden, all of our lives were shot into kind of a whirlwind. And so the first table read when we were all back together again was like, a big sigh of relief because it was all on common ground and we were all together before anything happened. So it felt like coming home. And, you know, even though we did one, two, and three in a fairly short period of time, it's only been like two years, I think, like all, all together, we've all grown so much as individuals and our characters are also growing as well. So being able to watch each other grow up as our characters are growing up was really, really cool as well. Um, to All the Boys isn't your typical teen rom-com. What do you think makes this story so appealing? Um, I think it's, I think what makes it so appealing is it's kind of like drinking like a, a warm cup of chicken noodle soup on a rainy day. Like it's just a comforting, relatable, um, the world that we've built looks 
and represents the world and the way that it looks out in the real world, which is awesome. Um, so I think that, you know, people can see, they believe it more because it just looks, it's colorful and beautiful just like our, our world. Um, and I, I think that it, there's a softness, goes back to the chicken noodle soup and that comfort. There's a softness to the movie um, that is like palpable and when you watch it, you can't help to have your heart like melt a little and it's easy to have a, is a, a like a cold hard heart today and so like to have that kind of melt a little I felt that and I hope other people felt that but that's people didn't realize they need they needed to giggle like when do we giggle in real life a lot like on our day to day and you do that in the movie and you kind of like feel like you had a warm cup of soup so yeah I think it's just it's soft and it breaks people down a little bit um, what do you hope audiences will feel or take away from the film? I hope that they take away um, that whatever you choose to do with your body at whatever time and with whomever, that's your choice. I hope they take that away. Um, and I hope they also take away, um, I hope they, I know that they'll, I know that they'll love the love triangle. I hope that they I I hope that they laugh a ton at Kitty cuz I think she's so funny. I know they will. I know they will. And finally, are you team Peter or team John? No. <laughs> no, I hate this question. <laughs> um I I I'm very happy. I I I I want to say I'm team I'm team Lara Jean. That's my answer. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey you guys. Hey, you guys, huh? Hey, you guys, Is yeah. that from the Goonies? Nice. Hey!